Now we are going to see how to multiply any number with the series of ones. That is, one, 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 and so on. Let me show you by taking simple examples. Of course, this you can do by any other multiplication method also, like Nikhilam or crisscross. Let me take 32 multiplied by 11. Now, in this case, the method is very simple. I will start from right hand side and I will write first digit as it is. After that, I will add the leftmost digit that is here 3 plus 2 is 5. Now there are no digits after 3. So I will write 3 as it is. So my answer is 352 in just one step. Now let me take second example is 64 multiplied by 11. Now pay attention here we will get the carryovers. As usual I will start from left first digit is 4. Second step I will do 6 plus 4 10. I have to write in this fashion. Next, I'll write 6. Now I got carry over 1. So I have to add to the next digit. Here I get 7, 0, 4. Now let me show you one more example, slightly bigger one. I will take a 3 digit number 652 multiply by 11. Now the steps are exactly the same. First, I will take these two as it is. Now remember, I got only two digits in my multiplier. So at a time, I can add maximum two digits. So now I will add 5 plus 2, that is 7. Now for the next step, remember the multiplier has only two digits. So I have to skip these two and now I have to add 5 plus 6, that is 11. Now I have to write this 11 in this fashion with the carryover. Now only 6 is remaining so I have to write as it is and my final answer becomes 7172 in just one step. Now let us take an example of multiplier 111. Let me take first example. It is 203 multiplied by 111. The method is exactly same only in this case I have to go to addition up to three digits. As a first step, I will write this three, then three plus zero, it is three. Then as I have three digits in multiplier, I can go up to three digits, that is three plus zero plus two is five. Now, zero plus two is two, and last two as it is. Let me explain once again, this 3 as it is, these 3 as a addition of 3 plus 0, this 5 as addition of 3 plus 0 plus 2, then I got this 2 as 0 plus 2 and at last this 2. So my final answer is 2, 2, 5, 3, 3. Actually I got this answer in just one step. Next, let me show you some bigger example. I'll track 2, 1, 0, say 4, 3, 2. And I will multiply them by 1, 1, 1, 1. Now in this case, I got 4 digits, so I can go up to 4 numbers. So 2 as it is. Then I will do 3 plus 2, that is 5. Then 4 plus 3 plus 2, that is 9. Now 0 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2. I can go up to 4 digits. 9 again. Now mind well, only 4 digits in multiplier. So now I will go one step ahead towards my left. So I'll skip these two and I will do now 3 plus 4 plus 0 plus 1. 4 digits. That is 8. Now 4 plus 0 plus 1 plus 2, 7 here. Now there are no more numbers left. So I'll have to take 2 plus 1 plus 0, 3. 
now 2 plus 1, 3 and 2 as it is. So my final answer is 23378995 and this answer in just one step. Now I am going to show you a typical example of conversion. Suppose we have 1202 multiplied by 44. Now you know that 44 can be written as 4 into 11. So when you got this 11, we can use our specific method of multiplication. So let's simplify it further. I get 4808 multiplied by 11. And by our method, I can directly write down the answer like 8, 8, again 8, 12 and 4. So my final answer is 52888. In this way, we can split the multiplier and use our specific method.